In this video, I would like to explain the concept of uh, priority in secure transactions. Now, priority may also be understood as competition between security interests in the same collateral. The idea is very simple, that if two or more security interests uh, reside in the same collateral, then these security interests have to be ranked if uh, the debtor has defaulted on all loans. Because the purpose of uh, priority is uh, to reward uh, the senior security interests and if something is then left in the collateral, then pay off the junior security interests. So by implication, priority or competition does not matter if uh, there is no competition between security interests. For example, if one security interest is after collateral A and the other security interest is created in collateral B, uh, there is no competition between security interests because they are you know, going after different collaterals. The competition does not matter and priority is irrelevant if the competing security interests are in the same collateral, but the collateral has sufficient value to pay off all competing security interests. So competition and priority matters only if there is not sufficient value left in the collateral to pay off the outstanding but competing uh, security interests. So law of secure transactions um, offers uh, uh, two fundamental principles of competition or priority. The first principle is that the security interests in different leagues, what I call leagues, uh, may not be able to compete with each other. For example, uh, unperfected security interests belong to one league and perfected security interests belong to another league. So whenever there's a competition between a perfected security interest and an unperfected security interest, the perfected security interest is always going to win. So we could say that the perfection league is always superior to the un perfected league. So that is the first principle that the perfection league or the perfected security interests are always going to beat the unperfected security interests. Now if the competition is within the same league, let's say that two unperfected security interests are competing with each other or two or more perfected security interests are competing with each other. So this is the competition within the same league. So there the uh, principle is uh, what I call the temporality rule, that whoever was first in time is going to be ranked higher than the other competing security interests. Now let's say that there's a competition between two unperfected security interests. Now because they belong to the same league, therefore temporality rule is going to apply to them. So under the temporality rule, whichever unperfected security interest was attached to the collateral first, that unperfected security interest is going to be ranked higher. Now, in, and now suppose that the competition is between two perfected security interests. Now because they belong to the same league, um, the temporality rule is going to kick in uh, to sort out the competition. So in this particular case, whichever security interest was perfected first, uh, that security interest is going to be ranked higher. So the league rule and the temporality rule, these are the basic rules of competition uh, designed to rank security interests 
under the law of secure transactions. Now, like anything, uh, <clears throat> law gives you a general uh, principle and then it creates a lot of exceptions to it. So, uh, even in um, competition rules, uh, the temporality principle is not always the decisive principle. We will see in another video that there are so-called super priorities given to certain security interests and these uh, super priority security interests are exempt from the temporality rule. So uh, a security interest uh, which comes later in time uh, may be able to successfully compete and defeat uh, a security interest which was uh, attached or uh, perfected uh, uh, in a prior time. So that I will explain in another video.